morning guys, we're here at Mazepa Bay Island. We've been greeted by a massive sea and a stunning sunrise to go with that. Um, the current's going to be strong today, but we've got the drone here, we've got the kites here, we're going to try to get some big baits into the deep. Um, we've got Andrew preparing some tuna, tuna baits now for us. We can drop out on the kite nine arm. And yeah, we're going to hold, hold thumbs, hope for the best. The big grey sharks have been around, um, so we should still get a couple pulls today, as long as our sinkers hold. So yeah, stay tuned guys. Cheers. Guys, I just want to discuss our trace quickly. Uh, this is the, the basic trace I've been using to catch these grey sharks. Um, I'm fishing a 14 note demon circle, Mustad demon circle, and I've snarled, snarled onto that. And I'm using 250 pound carbon coated steel. Um, and then I just tie a figure 8 knot there to stop the beads from sliding down. And then it's quite a long trace, it's about 2 meters long. I fix the beads here just to protect the swivel um, and stop the swivel from sliding over the loop. And yeah, that's, that's our basic trace. I fish that it's a 1.5 millimeter. And I've got that onto my Dogfight Lever Drag 60, which I've got pulled with 65 pound J braid and 0.70 on top of that, um, just for added stretch. And then I'm fishing that onto 1.5 millimeter. And I'm fishing the Dawa Salt is 8 to 12 ounce. It's a perfect rod for pulling these bigger fish, I reckon. And honestly, I think this is the, the most adequate setup you could probably get to target these really good sized sharks. And at the same time, if you hook a smaller shark, you can still have a lot of fun with it. Say a little bit about Mazeppa Bay. It's just absolutely stunning. This place. It's got so much uh, character to it. Um, it's insanely beautiful. The nature. The I mean, right now we're watching smashes with tuna, with dolphins, it's just insane. We've got whales in the background. Um, the beauty of the place, you've got to be here, to, come here to actually appreciate how beautiful it really is. The fishing's off the charts, um, and Mazeppa Bay Hotel is just, yeah, I, I, I go there purely because of the, the, the costing is brilliant, the accommodation, the friendliness, um, it's really a stunning, stunning hotel, and I've got a bite. I think it was a bird, huh? That was a bird. Oh, yeah, it's a bird, right? Sorry. That's how I get a So, yeah, um, carry on. It's a uh, yeah, beautiful place, and I would recommend it to absolutely anyone. Uh, the food is brilliant, the staff is brilliant. Really, really beautiful place. We've been greeted by a lot of fish activity, a lot of bird life, a lot of marine life, a lot of smashes going in the deep. We've seen a few, a few tuna, some sharks jumping, so yeah, we put some baits out now with the, with the drone, put out some tuna, tuna chunks. Uh, put baits out about 400 meters, 450 meters, quite far because of the sea size. The sea is really, really big today. Probably looking at about 2.8, almost 3 meters well. I have a big surge running. I'm fishing my dogfight lever drag 60 with 65 pound J braid on the back and 0.70 top shot and uh, 1.5 mil leader. Fishing that with my salt is 8 to 12 ounce, is what I've been using for my big sharks. And yeah, it's to the test. I love loving the setup, loving pulling fish with the setup. Uh, the braid is potent, I must say. <laughs> I've used a lot of braids and this, this braid has really impressed me a lot. So yeah, guys, stay tuned. Hopefully we can pull out a biggie today. Hopefully for a big gray shark again. Something maybe in the 300, 350 kilo range, that would be nice. So you guys stay tuned. Alright guys, we're on top of the island and no, we're not hooked onto the fish, we're, we're hooked onto the currents. We've got the most insane seas, most insane conditions today, some pretty insane surge. So, we put some baits up with a drone in the hope of, of finding a bigger fish and a bigger pull. Looks like the only pull we're getting today is from the current, so yeah, give it a bit longer here, see if the current dies off a little bit and then try to decide where we go from there for the evening session. We've 
got a giant swell today, a giant surge, a lot of white water, it's very uncomfortable to fish. Uh, my line got washed up by the surge. But now we we in a bit of a situation, we're thinking we got seaweed on the line, but now the seaweed's fighting a bit like a fish now. So, so yeah, let's see what happens. Um, there's still two thoughts about it, whether it's seaweed or a fish. If it's seaweed, it's fighting really funny. If it's a fish, it's also fighting really funny. So let's see. We'll, we'll see soon, hopefully. Sure, guys. Check you soon. Not sure what that was. Unfortunately, when she came close, whether it was seaweed or whether it was a shark, we're not too sure. It looked, it looked a bit like a fish, but yeah, you can never really tell. Um, the right chair, about five meters away from the rock, she let go of the bait. Doesn't even seem like she was hooked. Uh, it looks like she was just following the bait in and then playing with us a little bit. Then. So yeah, we're gonna get another couple of baits out and try our luck again. I know the surge is really big. Um, we're going to give it one more try and see if our bait sits and if we can get a pull. If not, I think we're going to head back to the hotel and go grab another bite to eat. Alright guys, we've got a bite here and it's going. It's my dad's rod, we just ran down. Maybe it'll be another, I don't know where you can see it. It's an interesting fish this, haven't seen it jump, very really fast. So yeah guys, let's try and get her out. Going, are hey, you?
Now you can't win them all and after a very long fight like that it is always very disappointing when things don't play along. The sea being as rough as what it was unfortunately did not allow a safe landing for this fish and the line broke right at the end. But as anglers we know you just get up, bait up and put another bait and better luck with the next one.